Chardonnay is, oh God, you know what? To me, if you want to know what Chardonnay is, try some white Burgundy first. That's, that's my introduction to, to real Chardonnay. I mean, I came out of California and that was, to me, not what Chardonnay really is. It's white Burgundy and it, again, it comes back to this thing about terroir and the vineyard and wild yeast and long time in the barrel and not new oak. Um, when I do Chardonnay, I ferment it with wild yeast in barrels that are no younger than three to four years old so that they can pick up a little bit of tannin from the wood for some structure, but they're not picking up aromatics and flavor of wood in them. I want the essence of the fruit. Chardonnay is a fantastic grape variety. I think it's every bit as expressive as Pinot Noir is, um, but it's but it's, um, but it's subtler and you need to give it time. And I think the problem in New World is we tend to rush Chardonnay too much. I mean, as I said earlier, we're impatient as Americans and letting it sit in Barrique for two years is just something that most people aren't willing to do. But if you give Chardonnay a chance to sit and mature, um, it turns into really amazing, really amazing wine. And there are some better and better examples of Chardonnay being made here. Um, when I, I mean, it's an indicator. When I moved more north from California and I packed up my wine cellar, I left all the Chardonnay behind. I didn't bring any Chardonnay with me. Because California Chardonnay, and it was stuff I was making too, was, it was high alcohol, it was tropical fruit. It just, it wasn't just wasn't what Chardonnay should be. Chardonnay should be subtle and, um, and it should be complex and it should have acidity. Um, 